Hi guys, we are back with some updates. Um, so I finally got my new budget planner in and um, made a few new um, cash envelopes, which we'll get to in a second. Okay, so I got this budget planner for I think like $12 on Amazon. Yeah, it was extremely affordable and it's really cute. Um, it's, uh, it looks like a lot of the fancy ones you see if you guys follow other people <laughs> on YouTube. They have like really fancy looking ones, but this one was like $12. So we'll go ahead and get into here. Um, and it's got like a place to put your, um, to put your cards and extra, extra spots. And it came with like different kinds of envelopes. Like there's the top, the envelopes that you can put things in from the top. So I just stuck like receipts in these. And it came, oh, it came with these budget sheets. I thought these were cute. So I've had this for about a week and a half now. So I'll go ahead and get into um, what I've done so far. Okay. So, oh, and I actually bought a laminator and I went ahead and made some little placeholders for my um, for my binder things. <laughs> it's just like a little sheet that I laminated. It's like miscellaneous, and then I just put it in here. And I made them kind of. I think I made them too big. But I want it to like cover most of the space so like money isn't showing through because I use this as my regular wallet. Okay, so we'll go ahead and get into the mid-month update. Okay, so I gave myself $100 in miscellaneous and on the 7th I went ahead and used $23 on toiletries and I went to Family Dollar again but I cannot find the receipt so I ended up spending I think $40 the second time I went to Family Dollar but I cannot find the receipt and then on Thursday the 14th I went to a doctor's appointment and that was $25 so let's see how much money we have left for the rest of the month So we have 20, 30, 31, 32, 33. So we've got $33 for the rest of the month in miscellaneous. So I, there's nothing else that I really need to get um, that I can think of. Uh, I need to get the boys some Halloween costumes, but I will use um, the money that I put into their, into my seeking funds that I have for them. Um, so next we have medications. So I, I usually take three medications, but I only bought two this month because I don't take my other medication. I don't have to take it every day like my other two so we should have eleven dollars and thirty thirty cent left over actually i need to get my um coin purse really quick okay so i made myself a coin purse and i'm sorry this is like a little off subject but i made this and um if you guys haven't already looked i have an etsy shop so i make I do a lot of sewing, so this is something I made for um, October. Okay, so let's see 
How much do we have? We should have $11 in here. Yep, five to 11. And then what is this? Oh, this is my receipt. So I've been keeping my receipts as well. Um, I just stick them back here or I could stick them in this little thing right here. So we have $11 left over and this will go towards next month. Okay, next is allowance. So this is my oldest son. Um, so he had, I usually try to give them $5 per week. And so he had $5 on the 5th of October and then he used that $5. Um, and then he had $5 last week and then $5 again this week. And he has a total of $10 and he didn't, he didn't use anything last week. So he should have $10 in here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. So ten dollars for him. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> so my youngest son, um, He's kind of, he's very ob observant and he likes to watch me. So he knows about his, um, he knows about this cash system that I do. And he, uh, he gets, he also gets the same amount of allowance as my oldest son. But as you can see, he uses, he's used up a lot of his. <laughs> <laughs> um, so he got $5 on the 8th, um, he got $15, so he had his total $20 for the month of October, and then he ended up getting, um, a couple extra dollars that he had left over from last month, so he had a total of $18 for the month. Um, he used Robux on the 13th, so that left him with $12. And last night I was, we were going through the budget sheet and he asked me if he could write his transactions down and I figured that would be a good idea and give him an idea of how, where his money is going. So he bought these four last night because he wanted to buy something on a game. So he ended up spending two, let's see, three, four, five, six. He ended up spending six dollars. So he should have six dollars left in his in his um envelope. So let's count these. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So he's got six dollars left. Okay, gas. Um, I have not driven that much this month. Um, as you guys know, I'm a full time college student, so I do most of my stuff online. Um, the program that I'm in is completely online except the field work that we have to do. So I don't, I'm not going to be getting into the field work portion until next summer. Um, so this next, the next few months I will be completely online. So this month I've only used $40. So for gas, I should have $20 in here. Dollars, and then back to the bank. I have one dollar. <laughs> back to the bank, one dollar for October. So, and that is it for this binder. <clears throat> okay, so we'll get into this. Um, I've decided that I'm going to make this binder my sinking funds. 
and I ended up making a lot of my envelopes and I think I thought these were really cute like I made them a little bit longer so like if you see some binders will have just clear right here on the edge like it'll be like three inches long like wide and then it'll be a clear edge but I wanted to just make the whole thing just with the cardstock and I just made hole punches on the side and these actually are on my Etsy shop um, I put these up two days ago so hopefully they do good um, Okay, so I don't really keep up with the money that goes in here, so I don't have budget sheets for these. Um, but I haven't really restocked or like added any money to these. So for kids, I only have like two dollars, <laughs> and I've got to add more because they're going to be wanting, um, they're going to want Halloween costumes for this year. Right, let me turn this this way. Okay. So that's for kids, $2 in kids. So next is school. School should be $10 still. Yep, $10. <clears throat> Car is $10. Phone. This is my favorite. Like, this is my favorite print right here. It's just, it's just so pretty. Like, it's butterflies and flowers. Phones should have 25 Yep, $25. Water has nothing because I've already paid my water bill. Uh, internet has nothing. I paid that. And that's it. That's it. Um, <clears throat> if you guys have any suggestions, like what I could add, um, I've thought about, I know I made a budget sheet in my last video, and I think I'm going to add like a gift. Um... A gift envelope and I'm also thinking about making more envelopes to go on my Etsy shop like regular ones and yeah that's about it so um, please like and subscribe as everyone says <laughs> and I'll see you guys next time